Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Sumanth. In this video, I am going to explain the main differences between artificial intelligence, machine learning, deep learning and data science. These are the common terms that you have to know in the field of data science. First, let us talk about artificial intelligence. Generally, before, uh, before talking artificial intelligence, you have to know one thing. Generally, as a humans, we have the capability of thinking. We can take our own decisions without, like, without depending on others. So, artificial intelligence is nothing but making the machine to think by themselves. So, I'm going to explain you with diagrams. Artificial intelligence making machine to think making machine to think for example if you take uh, if you take uh, self driving cars that is an example of ai application and if you take alexa siri these are the type of applica uh, ai applications so ai is nothing but a final end application we can say so uh, let's discuss about ml ml means machine learning machine learning is a subset of ai in machine learning we will have some statistical tools to explore the data and to get the insights from the data that is the there will be some raw data so we're gonna get some useful information from the data we're gonna use the data to train our models that's machine learning so it provides statistical tools in ml there are three subdivisions those are supervised learning unsupervised learning and reinforcement learning first let's talk about un uh, supervised learning supervised learning means the data will be labeled that means that uh, it means uh, if you take an example of predicting the how, uh, price of the house if you take that as an example we will give both the data means um, like if we are uh, we, uh, gonna give the features like uh, what location the house is present and number of rooms in the house based on that there will be part, uh, there will be particular price for that house so we gonna give those features along with some price so our model uh, our uh, supervised model will gonna learn from that data and it will be used to predict on unseen data that's supervised learning next one is unsupervised learning unsupervised learning it means that the data will not be labeled it means uh, there will be no uh, in previous case we have defined some like uh, labels uh, such as price for, uh, for particular features there are some uh, price but in unsupervised learning uh, there will be no labels the data will be clustered means uh, based on some features in the data based on some based on some patterns in the data the model itself will divide the data into clusters so uh, in this unsupervised learning we are going to use some algorithms like k-means clustering hierarchical means clustering db scan etc and the next one is reinforcement learning reinforcement learning and in reinforcement uh, reinforcement learning is also known as semi supervised learning it means that some part of the data will be clust uh, like labeled and remaining will not be labeled in this how the model will learn means based on the reward and punishment method it means that 
the model will be rewarded for the right uh, right moves and also uh, and it will be punished for the wrong ones so based on that the model will learn means which moves i have to make and which moves i should not make based on that it won't uh, it gonna learn that's reinforcement learning next one is deep learning deep learning is nothing uh, is the subset of machine learning dl before understanding uh, before going to deep learning you have to understand one thing that is why the scientist created deep learning if you take the uh, the method which is implemented in deep learning is artificial neural networks uh, it is created by inspiring from our human brain uh, our brain have uh, neurons several neurons so um, so in the same manner in order to mimic the human brain they have created this artificial neural network so in even in dl uh, deep learning there are three uh, main divisions like artificial neural networks cnn convolutional neural networks and rnn recurrent neural networks artificial neural networks convolutional neural networks and recurrent neural networks in ann we gonna give like numbers a number type of data like the data will be table in table form we gonna based on uh, based on uh, we gonna give uh, number type of data we gonna give in ann if you take cnn we gonna give image type of data like uh, if you want to classify into the image into dog or cat we gonna give directly the images will be given to the cnn model and next thing is rnn if you take rnn the data will be uh, time series kind of data and i am going to explain you the main differences between ml and dl uh, with four main points first one is human intervention and the next one is based on time hardware and the next is approach first one is human intervention if we take ml model uh, we gonna uh, for, uh, for example if you take an example of uh, classifying the image into dog or cat same the uh, for that problem statement if you want to use ml model we have to divide that Im uh, that image into pixel format and in that pixel should be like in that in the form of table then we have to give to ml model but if you take dl we can give it directly as an image format so for ml there is required of human intervention and the next one is time for ml mo uh, for dl model we uh, we required lot of data to train so definitely the time taken the uh, taken by the model to train also will be more and hardware definitely if the data increases the time increases accordingly the system requirement like hardware like hardware also uh, we, re we require uh, more hardware like more uh, gpus high end gpus tpus etc we require and approach how the ml model approaches a problem statement how the dl model approaches a uh, problem statement uh, statement uh, let me exp uh, explain with an example if we take like uh, if you want to detect a number plate on a car if you give if you want, if you take an ml model the uh, task will be divided into two approaches like object detection first and the next one is object recognition but if you take dl the both the task will be completed uh, treated as a single task that's the uh, difference in approaches next one is data science data science is nothing but getting insights from the data we gonna perform like data collection data cleaning data uh, there are uh, there are some other tasks we gonna perform those tasks so data science is nothing uh, it's a combination of ml dl as well as we gonna use some statistical and mathematical tools to find like uh, to get the insights from the data and in order to use that data wisely so that is data science so data science is the combination of 
ml and dl with some statistical and mathematical tools one thing you have to understand is ai is a final application which we gonna uh, which we gonna make by using this ml and dl and this all the statistical tools i hope you understood the difference between ai ml dl and ds these are the basic terms that you have to learn share to the one whom you feel it is useful thanks for watching